I head back to the village. I'm told to seek the advice of a man who could help me get to the bottom of this mystery, the witch doctor. They say he's a very powerful healer with an extensive knowledge of the fish in these waters as they have dark powers that affect his medicine. He's listed four fish, um, something called the Mbakibitu, um, Nyeru, Tuni, which I, I think is also known as the barbel or the catfish. And then here again is this fish called the Nguesh. He tells me that different fish have different powers. So the Nguesh is the most powerful fish. If he has eaten the Nguesh, he says the illness will, will multiply. It will become much stronger than it was in the first place. And for this reason, he doesn't eat Nguesh, he doesn't even touch it, he doesn't even allow it inside his compound. Um, I know you don't touch them, but is there any fishermen in the village, anybody here who could who could show me one? Or... Okay, so he says his, his daughter, uh, not in here, but if I go outside, uh, his, his daughter has, has got something that, that, uh, that she can show me. His daughter brings me what she calls the Nguesh, but it's not quite what I was hoping for. So these are the teeth of, of the Nguesh. I'll tell you what struck me first of all, it wasn't so much this, it was his reaction. He, he visibly backed away. I mean, it, it's, it's not just talk. Um, these are definitely, you know, powerful in, in his belief. Didn't want to be anywhere near them. Um, they look almost shark-like, these teeth. They've sort of crumbled a little bit, but I can tell that they are very, very sharp. But I'm still no nearer visualizing what the entire creature is like. 